you two. Our dad won the whole thing. Like seriously. Like that champion. that was crazy. Like oh my god. Like he won and then we were screaming. The he was a champion. And we all were doing our film and we were taking pictures, a lot of pictures. second to breathe and just wanted to hop on here and get some video for our post show vlog but uh, just wrapped up eating at a place here in Sugarland Texas called toast and uh, honestly it was phenomenal this little place back here if you can see it um, Lauren found it and it was absolutely great just had some avocado toast with eggs and bacon and then we tasted a couple different sweet items, the birthday cake pancakes, the Fruity Pebble French Toast, um, some kind of cronuts, like a donut with Nutella and bananas, and then Hank got a Fruity Pebble cronut, and I tasted that, so really, really good food. About to head over to Alpha Leet's, um to have our photo shoot and uh, get this day started. It is gonna be a wild day. Today is the after party and I am the first ever men's overall summer shredding champion. So I have no idea what is in store for today. So I'm gonna bring you guys along for that ride and we'll find out together. So let's head over to Alpha Land and get ready for this photo shoot. And hopefully I don't look like I just ate a bunch of pancakes. <laughs> He's an overall champ. He gets a photo shoot today. We texted Kirby and was like, is there any way like Lauren can jump in too? So I'm jumping in on this experience, but we just ate so much food. And now like I'm back in my bikini. Like we're <laughs> just ate so many pancakes. So now we're pumping up and we're about to go get pictures taken. Thank you. 
sword, a trophy. Yeah. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. Okay, yeah. so you're gonna step, you're gonna stand kind of where that like, cracking top is. Okay. Yep. Yeah. And then let me make sure that my lights are still good. I'm just like, what is happening? It is. He came out with that sword, and I was like, wait, what? How do we get home with that? My, our parents are at Bass for right now, trying to find a gun case that this will fit in that we can check. Oh, smart! I was yeah. like, yeah, TSA is not going to be a fan. About shipping it, but I'm like, I hate to get lost. Yeah, and you have to like wrap it and pull it out yeah. a million times. Yeah, that's super stressful. We're definitely making some shadow. It's like, of course we're gonna. So we are at the photo shoot and we've got literally all the, like, we've got a ring, we've got a trophy, we've got a medal, we've got a sword. <laughs> like what in the world? This is so much hardware, so much hardware. We also ate pancakes and donuts for breakfast, but you know, just trying to get it done. The carbs are hitting. And we got Kirby here, and she's great. She crushes it. So Hi. Her. So she's going to make me look like a beast. Yes. Hey, it's not hard. It makes my job easy. <laughs> there we go. Okay. We're in business. All right. Okay, same thing. Look at the side of it. Can I close the Kids are not allowed at the after party, which is very disappointing, but we got an amazing support system and they're taking them to have fun so that we can enjoy. Thank you. Look guys. at that. What are you eating, Hank? What's that? That looks good. Oh, mommy packed them a little oat bar. Wow. I love you, boys. Yeah, that doesn't fit right. right there. I don't know why. Maybe time to go to the after party. All right, we are at Alpha Land. Drinking the Alpha Land 3D. The 3D Alpha Land Edition Lemonade. Lem oh, it's very that's good. refreshing. This is my first energy drink since prep. I can't see you on the camera because my arms it's are okay. too tired. It's okay. Don't look at me. Look at you. But uh, yeah, we're getting ready to walk into the after party, hang out, maybe get a workout in a little bit. We just wrapped up the photo shoot, and yeah, we're here for whatever is about to happen. So let's go. Let's get into it. Alpha Eats. It's a place to be right now. Nice to be. I got some steak quesadillas on the way from Mama Guzman. About this Alpha Slim salad. It's like grilled chicken, grilled eggs, cherry tomatoes. I'm dying for a salad. Salad action. You got a steak quesadilla? Sweet. We had a I had some protein waters. We had the protein waters at the. Uh, Did you have a bomb? You have a bomb there. yet? I had a bomb. I had a ghost. I had a 3D. I got, I bought Christmas. I know, I was so excited. It's like those two little boys that were like, wow. The were so excited. Wow. Yes. Congrats. Thank you. I can't wait to eat your food. We're so excited. We've been here all week, but we haven't been able to eat your food. We're so excited. We're so excited. We're so excited. What's the best thing? Okay. So you feel like a hamburger. The Alpha Burger is the best. Okay. The quesadillas I heard were the The Tex-Mex, the steak quesadillas are the best. Okay. I want to do that. The the pastas, the mac and cheese with the barbecue chicken is is really good. We make the sauce with cream cheese, so it's really good. I want to do the steak quesadillas. Steak quesadillas? I don't know what I want. What are you going to have? All right, Lauren's got to decide, so we'll come back to filming. Ooh, a little Alpha Eats, Mama Guzman, quesadilla. Lauren went real healthy. Got a bowl of ca you got cauliflower rice? Oh, so good. What's wrong with her, Jess? What's happening? I just got a box. He ain't nothing in his. Just a box. All right, we're gonna dig in, eat this real fast. 
50 times 3 plus 85? Yeah. 85 plus 165. 700, 700 pounds, pounds right, right here. here. Yeah, wow. That doesn't include the gains we made. That's right. And we put muscle bags. That doesn't include the gains we made. That's right. 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 That's
side, we going all out. Go on, bring them out. Bring the giants out. Bring the giants out. Bring the giants out. Bring the giants out. We ain't never been scared. We ain't backing down. Bring the giants out. 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 No retreating now, go until we black out. Bring the giants out. Bring the giants out. I tell you what, Jess, I'm trying to film. Yeah, these are next level speed bumps. <laughs> Ready? Like, here comes another one. Little at Alpha Land, and the ah! speed bumps are like melt. Woo! They get you. We got two more. We got another one. Oh, gosh. No, it's one more. It's painful. Oh. oh, God. I couldn't imagine those in the, in the renter van. <laughs> All right, so we just wrapped up at Alpha Land for the last time on our trip, which is super sad because, man, I couldn't imagine getting to work out there on a daily basis. That gym is so freaking sick. The good news is, soon I will be an official sponsored athlete by Alpha Elite, and I will have to be coming back here for stuff, so. Yeah, crazy weekend. That was a little of our post-show day. I'm sure I'll film some more tonight, whatever we eat. Um, and hanging out with the fam, but we are wrapping up all of the summer shredding responsibility things and Now it's time for us to go be mom and dad and hang out with the boys and our family because they have literally spent the last like five days Doing that for us so that we could focus on Getting this W and now that that's achieved It's time for us to go spend some quality time with them. So no more summer shredding stuff. No more bodybuilding stuff for the next 24 hours uh, we leave tomorrow night. Jess is gonna run over a curb right here if he's not careful. Yeah, Jess, what are, are what are you doing? What are you doing? He literally parked on a train track. We're gonna die, people. This guy needs to move up. Show that guy right there. Oh gosh. Tweet, tweet. Tweet. Oh, there, there we go. Thank you. There we go. Yeah, that helps a lot. Nice. Curbing it. Anyways, so we are gonna go and get some food in a little bit and hang out. We just ate. We just had a smoothie at uh, Alpha Eats that was get some bomb. Food. We're gonna get some, get some snacks. Like, what? We're gonna get another meal and We're then some more snacks. <laughs> and I need some more snacks. Yeah, that, I mean that's pretty much what you do when you come off a of prep. You just eat. Pretty much. Eat and train. Yeah, Honestly, you like you do feel keep it clean. Like, I feel great after that workout and I feel like I'm looking right. Like I was looking massive and vascular and all the things. So anyways, if you've followed the journey this far, we appreciate you, because I know it's a mess, but uh, yeah, it's been a whirlwind, to say the least. We still have a dozen.
come together in the hotel room tonight with the boys and uh, maybe we'll all do like a little sit down and literally just open each cookie and just like everyone break a piece off and like pass it around and like taste it. I think w with all of us we could get through yeah, 12 cookies. Sizes. You know, like literally a bite size of each cookie to see what one's the best. There might be one in there that is like, hey, <laughs> ain't nobody getting that but me. There's actually two that I had my eye on, but I, I might share I might share a little bit of it. But anyways, I'm gonna stop talking now because I can ramble all day. See you guys in a little bit for whatever we're doing next. We are at a place called Flying Saucer. We're gonna go to a burger place called Union Burger that apparently is really good, but they're closed on Monday. A lot of things are closed on Monday here in Chicago. So we're gonna check out this Flying Saucer place, see what they've got, and uh, yeah, let's see what kind of food we can get. I'm trying to decide between steak freeze and pizza. I wanted a pizza all fresh, I'm kind of nervous. I don't know how to use the pizza I can use them or how to make pizza. So I may stick with steak. The time is up. I'll show it to you in the food films, but everybody's just hanging. Lauren's tired, doesn't feel good. <laughs> nice. We got Marshall doing the bikini pose. Corner turn to the right. That's it. Walking back to the line. Oh, I wish that was ours, but I don't think we were doing that. Chicken pizza? No, that's not our food. Bikini walk. Walking back to the line. These guys. It's like a big old giant fork, you know? Hank, where are you going? Wherever he wants. What are you doing? Are you tired? No voice. No voice. Mom, mom lost her voice. I was slap happy talking about the sword last I will be summer shred in 2024. You watch out for me. I will be there. I'll be back. What category? Figure? I'm going for chubby. Chubby. <laughs> I'll be in the chubby category. The master's chubby I'm going to get my arms as big as I can get them, and then my belly hey, even chubbier. Hey, your arm looks huge. I'm going to wear my that's chubby. That's because I tore my bicep. Yeah, so he uh, decided to just work out his biceps like three times a week. And you tore your long head? Are you still bruised? Any bruising still? Yeah, we're a little down. Bruising's gone. Breathing's gone. Yeah. Like good. a week ago, that whole arm was purple. Yeah. It's yeah. purple. It's purple. It's not He's purple anymore. He is Arnold. Arnold. I'm very drawn to the lens. Yes. Okay, get it out of my face. I'm so far away from you. Like, it's, it's a wide angle, so it's like... It looks like it's right I can see from me. here up. Nice. Yes. Nice. Yeah. All right. To Jeffrey. Congratulations. Cheers. Cheers. Very proud of you. Thank you. Real proud of you. A little tequila. So I went with the pizza and some carne asada fries. So we will see how this tastes. It looks pretty good, honestly. Not much undercarriage, but we'll see. Lauren made a much healthier decision. Salmon bowl. How's your Reuben? <laughs> Got a jalapeno sauce fry that's very, very hot. Spicy, spicy. Steak sandwich. Spicy, spicy. Very good. Very good. Burger. Good. Cobb salad. Very good. Everyone here did pretty good. I was a fatty. I got fries and pizza. But I didn't eat it all, so. Here's what it is. Flexing. Jake's always flexing. Oh, abdominals and thighs? Most muscular front double bicep. Oh, nice. Can you do side chest? 
Well, that, that side tricep, that's good though, too. There it is. Nope. Bring your elbow in. There he is. Side. Yeah. Nice. All right. Tell, tell the vlog. Say, see ya. See ya. Wowzers. Just finished dinner. It was okay. Not my favorite meal that we've had. Um, the meal that Lauren got was really good. She had some kind of salmon bowl with rice, like sushi rice and greens and avocado and jalapenos and um, I don't know, fresh jalapenos and sauces. I don't know, it was, it was delicious. Tasted it, very good. We told the kids we would take them to get ice cream and there's a Kilwins here, which they have in Wilmington, which is about an hour and 45 minutes from our house in Myrtle Beach. And it is delicious. We gotta drive there. And um, they're closed. They closed at 8, so super disappointed. But there is a marble slab, so we're gonna go to Marble Slab and get the boys ice cream. We're definitely gonna have a little bit. Still got still got abs, so we're good. Um, this place over here though, Escalantes, is where we ate last night. Phenomenal. So if you're ever in Houston, Sugarland, Escalantes is great. But yeah, we're gonna go check out Marble Slab, have some ice cream. We're getting in the car, it's super dark, you can't see me. Um, but yeah, stay tuned. A little ice cream. This camera's gonna die, so that's fun. But I'm gonna vlog the ice cream. I'm gonna vlog the ice cream on something, so see ya. Well, Marble Slab's closed at 8 o'clock. Their website's wrong, so we gotta let the crew know. They're gonna be mad, so now we're gonna have to drive to the other one that's farther away. So, yeah. Can't wait to break the news. That'll be fun. They closed at 8. They don't have their stuff updated. See, I get yelled at for everything. Ridiculous. Right. Go to the other one. What? Go to the other one. Hey, they closed said, at 8. We were like, I don't know if he comes back and he's just eating his ice cream. Yes, they were open. They closed at 8. That's our, like, that's the mantra. Of the All right, see you hey, we found a marble slab that's open. Over there, right there. We found an ice cream shop that's open. Three, 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 three tries later. later. So let's go get ice cream. I'm pretty full, but I'm gonna have to get some ice cream because why not? That's what you do when you're off prep. You have a little ice cream. So let's see if these people are happy that we're coming in here or not. They're fired up. So let's go get some ice cream. Jumping it up. And the vanilla. Vanilla, Reese pieces, Reese pieces, walnuts, and caramel. How is it? Delicious? Yummy. Yummy? What did you get? I got the caramel churro crunch. Ooh, that sounds nice. With sweet cream ice cream. Okay. Nice, nice. Levi, what did you get? Cotton candy, sprinkled corn. Gummy bears and a nutter butter. Wowzers. I didn't get a big Good. Hey. Hang, what do you want in your what do you want in yours? Wow. Gummy bears and MMs. Where's sharing though? We're sharing an ice cream because we have cookies in the room. And we have to do a cookie review tonight. Because we told Jess that we were going to do the cookie review. You coming over? I don't know. He hasn't responded to my text yet. But sharing was a good move because I couldn't eat a whole thing. No. We do eight like yeah. uh, lunch dinner type meals. Okay. We do four low carb options. Okay. We do a pound of chicken breast and two breakfast items. Okay. Typically we have some sort of like protein yeah. pancake and then... getting ready to pack up to leave Houston. We've had our fun of eating and honestly, we both feel like meh, don't really want any crazy food anymore. So I text Jess this morning. Hank doesn't want to leave. I don't want to leave either. I'm ready to not be in a hotel room. Um, but I've had a good time in Sugarland. 
we didn't actually see Houston at all. But anyways, I text Jess and asked him for kind of a reverse plan. When you do bodybuilding show, you really need to be careful coming out of the show. That's really where your diet matters so that you don't balloon and hold a bunch of water and have a bunch of issues. So we had our fun the last you know day and a half and now we want to dial it back in and get on track. So he basically told me 3,000 calories today, 200 grams of protein, keep it clean. Um, I went ahead and just set my macros at 200 grams of protein, 225 carbs, 70 fats, which is like low to mid 2,000 calorie range, knowing that I have like a six to 800 buffer in case I need it. Um, so this morning I'm making some oatmeal with some protein powder. Honestly, my body handles that really, really well, and that will be a staple going into the off season. And uh, yeah, we're packing up. We're gonna go check out the Children's Museum here in Houston. We heard it's really cool. And then grab some lunch. We were planning on doing Texas barbecue. And I just also don't. Heard, um, it's the best Children's Museum in the whole United States of America. We did hear that, so we will let you know if that's true. I don't know if I can handle barbecue, honestly. So we might pivot and do something a little healthier, but we're gonna see. So making some oats, and then we're gonna get this day started. So see you guys in a bit. See ya. Peace. All right, oatmeal's made. I went with uh, 64 grams of oats, a scoop of raw nutrition peanut butter protein, some nuts and more hazelnut blondie, and 133 grams of banana. So I'm gonna eat this and a little pink salt. Yum, yum, yum. all the things and uh, see what they got going on here so take you guys along for your ride all right we're still at the Children's Museum place is insane it's like how, how cool is this place boys super cool super there's like cool. so much stuff to do look I even made me my own wallet there's like got to be like 50 plus exhibits and then like this whole outdoor section and now Levi wants me to make a bat for him so Levi you want to film me making the bat yeah all right you hold the camera and hold it just keep it on the thing so show them the sign real fast what what's going on with that all right so now we we fold it and then we fold this piece back looks like we do it about like that and then looks like we match the other side Googly eyes. So, kind of tough. Oh well. Hey, Daddy, can I go show them the chicken? Yeah, sure. No, they baby chickens. Wow. Little baby, well, baby chicken. chickens. I didn't even realize those were in here. Yeah, they're actually good. Alright, let's sign off. You want to do the sign off for me? Yeah. Alright, here, let me hold the camera. Alright, say, say, we'll see you. We're getting ready to go find some food. Say, yeah. we'll see you when we get to the food place. See ya when we get to the food place. All kinds of stuff up in this place. We'll check it out. See what they got. All right, we went with a spicy tuna bowl. A little ahi tuna, avocado, cucumber, some sushi rice, and some mixed greens on the bottom. Trying to keep it clean. Lauren likes it. Hank got some pizza and salad. Levi did the pizza and salad. Mom got some lumpy and pancit, a little Filipino food. 
And you got the Philly cheesesteak grilled cheese with fries. <laughs> Yours looks the best. Very clean. Yeah, yeah. No, mine is like best. dirty clean. That fry looks delicious right with the there. Parmesan this is waffle perfect, fries. Please. What? Cheesesteak can change your life. Boom, boom, boom. All right. We're going to dig in. Oh, boy. What do you say? Oh, look at how much you just put on the top, baby. Or maybe not. All right. Is that yummy? Yeah. Yummy. Yeah. Yeah, you want me to hold your items? Yeah. And I'll drop it off? Okay. Yeah. Oh, my God. Is it good? Oh. The tuna bowl we had didn't have a ton of protein in it and trying to really hit my protein goal will be around 3,000 calories today so I wanted to get some extra protein so we got a little protein smoothie from this place called Thrive Juice. My man let us film it which was dope and uh, yeah it looks really good so it's a PB&J. Mm. That is delicious. Like really, really thick, but velvety and smooth to the taste. So, very nice shake. <laughs> What'd you have to do? You gotta lift the heavy bag. She might need help with that one too. Got the heavy bags. Alright, we made it to the airport. Got all eight bags checked in, including the sword. Broke a sweat. Whirlwind, but now we're just hanging out. There's a little food court here and uh, just waiting. My stomach is a wreck from yesterday's food. I had some pizza and some fries at dinner and it, it is just not not working out well for me. Tried to clean it up a lot today. Had oatmeal, had like a spicy tuna bowl for lunch, then a protein shake. There's a little breakfast spot here, so I'm gonna do some like eggs and toast and bacon and potatoes just because I feel like it'll be a little bit easier on my stomach. And then I've got one of these Anna bars that they gave us at the show. Interested to try this out. It's like a Fruity Pebbles flavored one. And then I have some raw nutrition uh, chocolate peanut butter pre-prepped in a shaker bottle that I can just add water to. So I'm gonna have that. If I stick to just all that, I will hit right under 3,000 calories, like 230 grams of protein, and uh, be pretty good for the day. And then really start to dial it back in tomorrow, and then as we go into the weekend. So the goal isn't to be like super restrictive or be, you know, weighing every meal. Like even today, I tracked, but I don't have the exact measurements of all the stuff. The goal is just to try and make good decisions post-show so that you don't end up gaining 20 or 30 pounds in like a five-day period. Obviously, when you step on stage, you're at an insanely lean, dehydrated weight. And so gaining like 10, 15 pounds is nothing. I mean, it's not, you're not gaining fat. You're just gaining back water and, you know, glycogen in the muscle and stuff like that. So my goal is to kind of stay around 200 pounds. I got down to 188 for show day. And uh, yeah, so we'll see how that goes. Try and clean it up a little bit before we start our off season and gaining weight on purpose. So yeah. Any thoughts? I'm ready to be home. 
feels like we've been in Texas for so long. I'm still trying to like process everything and yeah. So honestly, I feel like we're like a day behind each other since my show was Saturday and Jeffrey's was Sunday. Yesterday I felt more sluggish and my stomach was just like a mess. And like we got to dinner and I was just like, I'm tired, but I feel good. So today I feel like really good. I'm fueling myself with really good protein and rice and just really trying to keep the diet super simple. And I feel really good. I woke up really like, honestly not as bloated. I feel like I look leaner. Um, so I'm feeling better. So just ready to get home and like get back into a routine. Yeah, another thing too, you uh, forget how much water you're drinking on prep. And it's really easy a couple days after the show when you're traveling and you're doing things to uh, not drink enough water. So really focusing on getting fluids in and trying to get my water in. I have not done a great job today, so I just downed a big liter of smart water. I'm about to down another one and then continue to hydrate as we fly home. So see you guys in a bit. All right, so I ended up getting some breakfast food. Too shabby looking. Not sure what's in this. Oh, there's my. So I got four eggs, so they decided to put them in a separate thing. But yeah, Lauren got a little bowl chicken, rice. Is it good? It's really good. Just, it's literally just chicken, rice, cucumbers, and tomatoes, and onions. Nice. And the kids got um, a sub. I got to change my macros because I thought I was getting two pieces of toast, but I only got one. So that'll work. I'm going to eat it up. Okay, you want to film me while I'm doing eating it? Okay. In that hotel. No. It was so tiny. Too tiny for you? Yeah, and that was the biggest room they had. Oh my goodness gracious. I do. I love airplanes. <laughs> wow. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's straight out of the five year old's mouth. That airplane sucks. He doesn't want to be on it. So. Sometimes. It made me think of the cruise. Maybe, you know what they did say, huh? Thank you. We made it to Atlanta, so headed to our connecting flight and then we'll be back to Myrtle. Pretty easy flight, so not too bad. You're no longer huh? allowed to be in during the flight. That was much quicker. No listen, need to go to listen. I was just trying to be fiscally responsibility and use mileage. And no longer allowed to be frugal. Listen. Just because you get a little extra money doesn't mean you spend it all, okay? I'm trying, I'm trying to save that money, all right? Time is money. Time is money, but the flight from LaGuardia wasn't that bad. Let's, let's be honest. This was better, but it is what it is. We made it. And uh, yeah, head to the next flight. So let's go. Everybody's on. Levi. We're on the escalator. Everybody riding up the escalator. Going to the gate. We had a one hour ride. One hour. Yep. We're going to have a two hour plane ride. Two hour plane ride? Yeah. You ready to be home? Yeah. Tired? Yes. It's 7 p.m. at night. No, it's later than that. Check your watch. What time is it? 9.21. That's back at home. We are back at home. We're back in Atlanta, which is the same time zone as Myrtle Beach. Oh, so yeah, it's 9.21. Yeah. 
Texas was like a different state. Texas is one hour behind us. Yeah. They're central, central time. Yeah, they're 821. Yeah. All right, we're stepping off. Here we go. Flex is everywhere. He's Mr. Flex. We have made it back safely to Myrtle Beach. We've got all the luggage loaded up, all eight bags. It's 12.30 in the morning. It's 12.30 a.m. Not enough light to film very well, but we're here. Oh, there we go. We made it, so. Everybody's here, everybody's happy, everybody's ready to be home. Uh, Tired, TSA stole one of my locks. These things are 30 bucks a piece. Not a fan, TSA. I guess they had to like, I mean. I, they have a key, they're TSA approved. Uh, what, that doesn't so make just, any sense. They just took one of my locks. I always wondered that. Yeah. So, so. TSA has universal They have universal keys, keys yeah. Smart. Yeah. And I was like, they're gonna need to cut into that. Yeah, but anyways, heading home now. Got to unload the car. And then we got to get to bed because these boys got to go to school in the morning. So we got to get up in like five hours. <laughs> so. And then Lauren and I have an extremely busy day because we decided to plan a four-day camping trip well, after this. Well, it was planned way, like before, you way before we even bodybuilding. decided to do this insane life. So anyways, thanks so much for watching. Uh... I guess this is just post show. I guess I'm gonna combine the two days into this one video, but post show, travel home. I'm gonna do a whole sit down talk. Maybe we'll do like an uh, creamies and questions talk. I don't know, tomorrow or the next day. And I might even put that out before the show day video because it's gonna be um, it's gonna be a couple days before the show day video is ready to be edited because I'm waiting on the footage from the show. So I paid um, for professional footage for the show and they're telling me that it's probably gonna be next week before they get me that footage and I really don't wanna rush the show day videos because the footage that they got plus all the behind the scenes footage that I captured is gonna make both Lauren's and my show day video really, really great. So I know we've been uploading like almost every day, so I'll probably upload we might just need a video uh, of just like some thoughts. Cause obviously if you follow us on social media, you know what's happened already. So anyways, thank you guys so much for following the journey. We love you, we appreciate you. If you haven't subscribed already, subscribe like this video leave a comment let us know what you want to see we've got man just a whirlwind of things coming and who who knows i'm not even sure what's about to happen um so yeah let us know what you want to see what you like what you don't like and uh we'll go from there so have a great night see you on the next one peace